And we are live. There we go. Sorry, I use a cord, uh, <laughs> corded con cord controller. I find it's more, uh, what else? What's the word for it? Um, accurate and streamlined. Downside to it is I can't use the Psy axis uh, stuff, which if you know, if you watch my Killzone videos, you'd know that. Anyway, let's get into this. I'm gonna go Titan. My vengeance ends now. Hell fucking yes. My brothers. We were forged in victory. Mm. A victory that ended the Great War and brought forth the reign of Mount Olympus. <laughs> Born from the depths of the underworld. Rooted in the river of souls. Our mountain emerged out of the chaos. <laughs> as it grew. So too did the might of the Olympians. He created a world of peace, a world of prosperity, oh, damn. a world that lives in the shadow and safety of my mountain. A mountain that has come to be the absolute measure of strength and power. And we're going to tear this mountain apart stone by stone. Now, on this Day. That power is to be tested. The mortal Kratos seeks to destroy all that I have wrought. He's not immortal, he's a demigod. Brothers, put aside the petty grievances that have splintered us for so long. We will unite. We will stand together. And I will wipe out this plague. <laughs> Olympus will prevail. Exactly how the second game ended, too. That's what I like about it. <laughs> Helios with his chariot. Hermes running down. Hades, Hades just fucking Spider-Man's in the combat. <laughs> Hell fucking yeah. Gaia. This is my favorite mechanic right here. <laughs> just being able to grab some of the lesser people and just be like, or lesser enemies, I should say, and just use them like a batter. Play. 
There we go. Thank you, Gaia, because evidently Kratos, he may be a badass, but fire is his main weakness. Oh, thanks for letting me lift this. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It's been so long since I've played this. Start the stick. I'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, what the hell? Oh crap! Man. Pretty sure that's beside. Fuck. Oh, ow, yeah, yeah, that's a problem. Like I said, God of War, amazing fucking action set pieces. This is a hell of a way to start a fucking game, especially if you're a fan of the series. Right where the last one left off. Oh, great. up again, or vertical, or horizontal, or however the hell this is depicted. me to have some fun. Oh, damn. He's really putting the chain blades to good use. But he's had them for years, so... playing these games, like, in a row for a while, so, I'm like, I am so, like, I wouldn't say over it, but I'm, s oh, well, there's Hades. Oh, okay, register experience. There's really nothing I can level up, so. But I'm, I wouldn't say I'm so over it, but I am so, like, I, you know, hey, it's just, uh, okay, time to hack and slash my way out of this again. <laughs> like, like, I wouldn't say I've seen it all, but I have sure as hell seen a lot at this point. Oh, oh damn it. Poseidon and Guy are duking it out. All right. It looks like Poseidon is winning, so... As soon as possible. Oh, yeah. I hate the little enemies.
Might as well grab some health. Fuck it, why not? I might as well read some lore. The Chain of Balance. Its unrivaled strength secures the bond between the Olympus and the Underworld. Cyclone of Chaos, still one of my favorite uh, moves. That and uh, Lance of the Furies. Lance of the Furies is one that you only ever see, if I remember correctly, in... Uh, I believe it's only in the first game. In the first game, you ever, you, it's the only time you ever see Lance of the Furies. Oh, and Apollo's Offensive. Apollo's Offensive is another one that you only ever see in the first game, just for the fact is that there's no um, L1 and X in the second game. At least I don't believe so in Do -do. And climbing up. Oh! Jesus Christ! Straight through the like a like a fucking chest burster. Oh yeah, and the the wings I stole from Icarus in the last game. lore here. <laughs> uh, I thought I smelled horse shit. I just love how they try to pile on. Giddy up! Oh, let's see how cra a long cradle's can hang on. Oh, oh, he's got him to the ground. Ooh, right in the chest, and oh! Guts hang out. Oh, fucking awesome. Oh, man. Is that it? Okay. Yeah. Oh, it releases a platform and all that stuff. Alright. And all that jazz. Oh, wait a minute, I can read lore. Here lie the remains of Ares, the fallen god of war. Oh, damn. Oh, shit, man, this is where they've been keeping you? Fuck. That's... I'm a little surprised. But, uh, you know, I didn't think Dad wanted you around. Oh, crap. Oopsies. I do like how this is the first game that you actually see, well, this was the first game up until that point where you actually see Kratos run with his blades. Because, like, that, that's one thing I never really liked about the series, is that whenever you moved, like, they immediately jumped on your back, and I'm like, eh, like, I, like, I, I, like, they always show him pulling them out, but they never really show him putting them back. Like, you know, or they show that very rarely, I should say. Yeah, I know I am hurrying. Oh shit! Do you even lift, bro? Okay. Okay. Oh, 
Alright, that's the hell of a way to get a to get a lip piercing. Not a way I'd recommend though. This bitch. killed not just many a god, but many a creature. So he's like, I know how to handle this shit. Boom! There goes one limb. death. Come on. Salute! Yeah, well, everything's powered up, so there's really no... Yeah, this game and the second one is the one that I kind of get a little frustrated at. And the only reason why I get a little frustrated at it is because why would they... But like, why would you give them, like, why would you give me red orbs when I'm not even going to get a chance to use them? Like, that is kind of the biggest dick move ever. Oh. No, 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 no. You get back down there where you belong. is more impressive because he's doing it one-handed. But like the second one is like, oh, he's using both of his arms. And then this, just, just, just this right here. Just, just, bam! Like just completely severing it. It's fucking, that's just fucking awesome. I'm sorry. I don't mean to fanboy out, but this game, like when this came out, like, yeah, yeah, like, like when this game came out, like it, it was, it had such an impact on me. Like I was in, I was in, I was in like eighth grade. I was a very unpopular kid, and I, and I, and I loved this series. And when it finally came out, oh god, it was okay. Time to rip it open. Okay, time to perform a little bit of open heart surgery. And there we go! Knocked it off for like it wasn't shit. You alright there, guy? <laughs> Oof. Yeah, I remember when I was in 8th grade, I was like, yeah, man, I, want, I know I want to be inside a woman, but this is not what I meant. <laughs> and then you can just kind of slide it. Yep, there we go. And 
There it is. Her heart. Heart of Gaia. So what do I gotta do? Give her a jump start? <laughs> These are drawings of my father. Oh, Zeus's eagle, a prized possession of Zeus. Beat the game to use this item. Remnants of Zeus's childhood cover the walls. And to think Zeus would be so ungrateful to the person that, uh, you know, saved his life. Anyway. Can I move in any other way? And there we go. Oh. oh yeah, this is the first time that you get, you would just turn it. And there we go. Like a glove. You, let you live. Probably not, but you, you never know. This was another thing that I really enjoyed about the series at this point, is that, uh, well, at least with three, is that it also expanded this kind of combat of, like, when you're climbing around. I, I, like, I loved that, because you actually could do, like, minor combos. Granted, it wasn't a huge part of the game, but it was still, like, the creators noticing that you're going to be doing this a lot. Oh. oh, crap. Another one? You challenge me, mortal? A god of Olympus? A true warrior does not hide, Poseidon. Leave the sea and face me. Disrespected the gods for the last time, Kratos. So, Poseidon, what you're really saying is. So, so what you mean to say is you're a pussy, alright. Okay. Old talk. You may, be, you may be a god, but I've killed many a god for you. Take that 
Ah, damn it. Should have rolled back. Yeah, see, now this feels like Titan. Okay, now he's bringing up the trident. Now. Yeah, he's bringing up the trident a little early. Just imagine the pain guy I must feel. Done, Uncle Poseidon? Alright. Aw, oh, damn it, I went right into his fist, too. Okay, let me just uh, climb up here. All right, Uncle Poseidon. Now you may feel a little tinge of uh, that's just me trying to kill you. All right, you're gonna feel a little bit of pressure. Uh, what are you made of? Fucking vibranium or onyx or something? And and there we go. Chest is exposed now, Uncle Poseidon. Right. Hot potato. Then all of Olympus will die. And Gaia with a left hook right on Poseidon. Up. Oh. Up. Oh. oh. What? Poseidon's horde wards it off. Uh oh. Okay, time to swing over. Kratos with the assist. Boom! And Gaia following through on that left hook. Kratos jumps off, and tackles Poseidon right through his little fucking monstrosity. Oh, God. Boom. Just damn. Again, what a way to open a game. Also, the design, the, the how they designed all the boss fights in this game. Fucking phenomenal when you consider what all the gods are. What all the gods are the god of. Zeus should have kept you where you belong. What, hidden? No matter how many gods fall, there will always be another to stand against you. They will fall as well. <laughs> the death of Olympus means the death of us all. Then prepare for your death, Poseidon. <laughs> See it from Poseidon's perspective is even more fucked up. And you're, and you're really seeing the fear in his eyes now. You see him trying to get to the ocean to draw from it. Oh! Oh, as a guy who had an eye injury or has one, oh, snaps his neck and just throws him off. Now 
that is some biblical shit right there. Releasing the floodgates. Tomb of Ares. Basically, guys being our uber up to Mount Olympus. Zeus. What will you do, father? You can no longer hide behind the skirts of Athena. Athena yep. is dead because of the rage that consumed you, Kratos. What more will you destroy? The hands of death could not defeat me. The sisters of fate could not hold me and you will not see the end of this day i will have my revenge excellent child i will tolerate your insolence no more i thought he's like i will tolerate your insolence no more like really yeah. zeus parenting 101 not be there for your child i'm pretty sure if he'd been there to offer some guidance like you know more gods would still be around There goes her hand. Ooh. I can hold on no longer. Stab your blades. You, we will both fall. Even now, Zeus gains. The destruction of Zeus. Is why you saved me from death! I saved you all to serve the Titans! Do not deny me my revenge! Listen carefully, Kratos. You were a simple pawn, nothing more. Zeus is no longer your concern. This is our war, not yours! Mm. And so he gets betrayed again. Cast away. Like he was nothing. I have lived as a warrior. I have died as a god. Having suffered the ultimate sacrifice, I have been denied release. I... I will defeat Olympus. I will have my revenge. I love the art direction there. This is the first time he's ever fallen into the river of sticks. River of sticks. I do love how in this one, how you lose all your stuff, though, because it honestly does make sense. I mean, he's swimming down the river of sticks, like, the, you know, he should be dead. They all drain his magic. And I love, if you look close enough, you can actually see his blades, like, rusting. There's the last of the experience, so you can't level up your stuff. And I love how you see him all just like limp out. Like he, you can clearly see all that damage that the souls did to him in the river of sticks. The just the draining, the draining of everything. Just problem of Hades. Just, just like you just see the toll it took on him. I love it. I don't know what it is about me, but I always love that attention to detail. We. 
not finished, Zeus. The gates of Hades have never held me. Death cannot hold those with purpose, Kratos. Athena. I have missed you, Spartan. I... I don't... But my sacrifice to save Zeus has brought me to a higher existence. You still appear to be an Olympian. Appearances can be deceiving, Kratos. So can the children of Olympus. <laughs> Perhaps. But remember, my death came by your blade. My blade was meant for Zeus. Be quick with your words. As we speak, the war for Olympus rages on, and mankind suffers. Let them suffer. The death of Zeus is all that matters. Zeus will not fall as easily as Ares. To destroy the king of the gods, you must seek the source of his strength. The flame of Olympus. You once sacrificed yourself to save Zeus, and now you seek to destroy him? What has brought about this change? <laughs> I see truths where I did not before. Perhaps these will earn back your trust. If you also look closer, you can see the difference. E e e the Blades of these Chaos. The blades yeah, the of Blades of Exile. They will help guide you on your journey to the flame. Remember, as long as Zeus reigns, there is no hope for mankind. Destroy the flame, Kratos, and the very foundations of Olympus will crumble. But I also love... Okay, Blades of Exiles. These blades will be your most powerful ally against Olympus. One thing I love about... Uh, if you look close enough... And I'm gonna show you really quickly. View. The... The... The design is completely different. Now, that's what I've always loved about between the Blades of Chaos, Blades of Athena, and the Blades of Exile, is they've always changed, like, just complete style. And I love this, because it shows you how, like, it reflects the different, uh, what is it, like, creators. Here is the end of the great journey that all must embark on, where none can turn back. <laughs> 